Hi, and welcome to Mr. Edwards' GCSE PE Revision Sessions. These videos give you the option to pause, freeze, and rewind the lessons at your own pace. How the cardiovascular and the respiratory system work together. The cardiovascular and respiratory systems work together to supply muscles with a continuous supply of oxygen. They also work together to remove carbon dioxide. When someone is taking part in physical activity, they have to work harder because the demand for oxygen increases and there is more carbon dioxide to remove. How it all works. Air is inhaled. Air then travels through the respiratory system to the alveoli. Gaseous exchange takes place at the alveoli. Oxygen diffuses into the blood and the capillary. Oxygenated blood is carried from the lungs to the heart via the pulmonary vein. Oxygenated blood enters the left atrium, moves through the bicep cuspid valve and into the left ventricle before being pumped towards the rest of the body via the aorta. The aorta carries oxygenated blood to other arteries. The arteries carry the oxygenated blood to the muscles and organs all over the body. Oxygenated blood moves through the capillaries where gaseous exchange takes place. Oxygen diffuses into the blood and the blood is now deoxygenated. Deoxygenated blood enters the right atrium through the superior vena cava and the inferior vena cava. It moves through the tricuspid valve into the right ventricle before being pumped towards the lungs via the pulmonary artery. Oxygenated blood moves through the capillaries where the gaseous exchange takes place. Oxygen diffuses into the blood and the blood is now deoxygenated. The pulmonary artery carries deoxygenated blood to the lungs. Gaseous exchange takes place at the alveoli. Carbon dioxide diffuses into the air. Air travels back through the respiratory system and is exhaled. Thank you for listening to Mr. Edwards' GCSE PE revision videos. If you have any questions, feel free to email me on damianedwards at kingselbarsha.com. Cheers. Bye.